Welcome to Hong Kong, a city like no other. It's easy to be mesmerized by the lights, busy locals, and constant activity. While this metropolis is a feast for the eyes, rarely does anyone talk about the lush soundscapes this densely populated place has to offer. I'm Libby, and this is Marcel. We're traveling field recordists, capturing unique sounds all around the world. In this video, we take you on the streets of Hong Kong at night, the time when the city truly comes alive. And now we just got out of the Shangshui Port Station here in Hong Kong, and what can I say? It is amazing. We're just a few days here in Hong Kong. We love everything about it. To get like another perspective and a different vibe, you have to come here out at night. And what I'm going to do is recording night sounds. So let's do it. Okay, so the biggest challenge for me here is music. So I have to find a spot where I can avoid music, so more like people, crowd noise. And if you're wondering, yeah, this is the wild tronics that I use most of the time now. It's just great. So I think that's a good spot here. So this stuff is amazing, but what I really love is these small side alleys. That's that's my favorite thing here. It's, I, I love this. Just like this street. So let's see what we can find there. A lot of good stuff. Or this, for example, right here. You know, like you have like the dripping right on the cardboard. You listen to the sound through the Wildtronics, so we have a lot of ambience, right? So I have the DAT with me, and let's just hope it's still dripping. So I'm gonna change the microphone really quick and record this with the DAT S Mic 2S. And while I'm setting up the recording, as I have set up the DAT, always a good idea, and I have three friendly women behind me. And now let's see how the deity sounds like with all the ambience, but facing really close to the cardboard. I think it sounds pretty good. And if you're wondering what this microphone is, this is the Zoom H3 VR. Ambisonic sound and if you go to zoom they already have a new one um, That's the Q6 I think. Oh, and we have a person coming oh. Sorry Wow, oh my god, that's why I love Hong Kong at first Everybody minds his own business. Nobody cares what we're doing. Of course, a few people look, but nobody comes to you. I remember when I when I was in Vietnam, right, and I put up my microphones. Oh, people surrounded me. Here, nobody surrounds me. It's cool. Love it. I get another one. Oh, they're so good. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Is it Saidi Fai Dong? Happy one. New Year? Yes, Happy Year. Ba Oh, that's totally different. Oh. Okay, so look what we found here. Oh, this is like a bean paste, and they're only available around this time to New Year. Oh, it's very like oily. Mm. Oh, look, it's. I'm swimming in oil. I'm so good. <laughs> mm. That's another red bean cake. Oh. But I love that man. more. <laughs> Mia. I love that more. Why 
一碟豆腐，兩嚿蘿蔔糕，一碟走豆腐，一碟走豆腐。So we could probably stay here the whole night recording sound because this is an incredible spot. But you see here, our train arrives. We want to show you another amazing spot. So you might have seen on Instagram this building here or that building. So the most people go there to take pictures, right? But we go there now to record the sound. So we just came out of the MTR station and it was just too overcrowded. They actually closed down because now they start counting the people who have to get in. So for us, it's time to get a little snack and then we heading out to the place that we want to visit. And I do have to say, in Hong Kong, I think I saw the most Teslas. So many Teslas here in Hong Kong. Okay, now we're here at the South Horn playground and recording soccer player and also basketball in the background. And this is so cool, you know, we, we actually on our way to a different spot, but because in Hong Kong is so much going on all the time, we have to stop and record that. And if this would be a professional soccer game, you would actually see people with a microphone like this and a dish and they're running up and down, up and down just to get the sound of the, of the players. So it's pretty cool. I always get excited when I see soccer players because I, I was a soccer player but I also was a coach. Yeah. Okay, so we finally made it to the Yik Chong building and uh, there are actually signs that show that please don't do videos, don't fly with the drone, don't have anything to do with photography, but nobody mentioned no sound. So what we're gonna do is, because we respect that, is I'm going capture some sound and we show you Instagram photos of other people who came here and took pictures and you get the sound. Wow, so who, what can I say? It's, it is it is just so amazing to, to be here, right? To not only in Hong Kong, just this this area here is wow, you know, you just look up, my, my neck already starts hurting. What we're doing now is we slowly make our way back home, trying to catch the ferry, because the ferry is also really cool with some great sounds. So let's do this.
So we just got out of the ferry and it was a great ride. Great sounds, super excited to have that recorded. We are at the end of the video. We really hope you enjoyed it and seeing and listening to Hong Kong from our point of view. So we would say thank you so much for watching. Leave us a comment if you like this video or if you want to see more of this kind of style, we do it. Wherever we go, we have our microphones. So let's do it. Good night. <laughs>